The Halloween season is upon us, and there is no shortage of fun events for local families to enjoy. Recently, Orion Township hosted one of its most popular events, and a little rainy weather couldn't dampen the spirit of those taking part. On Friday, October 15th, more than 200 children and their parents arrived at the Orion Center for the popular Halloween Boo Bash event. Due to the rainy weather, everything was moved indoors, where games and trick-or-treat stations occupied two floors of the Orion Center. So normally for Boo Bash, we have a lot of events outside our trick-or-treat street, carnival games. We have a hay wagon ride um, to a pumpkin patch and, um, and, and a few things inside. But with the weather this year, we were forced to move everything inside. So for today, we have about 10 vendors doing our trick-or-treat street. So um, they'll all get you know, candy or goodies from each local vendor. Uh, we have Leslie Nature Science Center here. They have live bats, owls, and a tarantula. Um, and we also have different carnival games. Oakland County is here with their um, large uh, yard games. We have uh, different arts and crafts, and we have cider and donuts and hay wagon ride to a pumpkin patch. The Boo Bash was created in 2008 at Friendship Park, but moved to the newly completed Orion Center in 2012. In 2020, the Boo Bash was held at Friendship Park due to the pandemic, but returned to the Orion Center in 2021. When the rain lightened up, families boarded a hay wagon and took a trip to a makeshift pumpkin patch where the little ones could claim their very own pumpkin. On the lower level of the Orient Center, Lisa Usselman of the Leslie Science and Nature Center showed off some creatures typically associated with Halloween. Well, probably the first thing that you're noticing right here is our barred owl. Um, he is a species that you can actually find in Michigan. So one of the big things that we like to talk about are animals that can be found around us and how we can actually do our part to protect the habitats of these kinds of animals right in our own backyards. Um, some of the other animals that I brought, though, are animals that you'd have to travel a little bit farther away to see. So um, over here, I have a tarantula. You'd have to go all the way to South America to find her. Or farther down the line, we have some fruit bats that would be found in Africa. Now, all of these animals play important parts in their habitats, no matter where you can find them. But especially around Halloween, I like to bring animals like this because sometimes these animals get a bad rap for being maybe scary. But turns out they're really important in nature and they do a lot of really great things for us humans. So that's my biggest goal tonight is to show people how exciting they are and how not scary they are. Event organizer Jesse Hayes wanted to thank the sponsors and volunteers who came together to make this year's Boo Bash a success. My park staff, my co-workers, the programmers, um, waste management for sponsoring the bats and uh, owls, and then all of our local vendors. Um, and uh, Oakview Middle School, they are the helping hands. They are great volunteers. We definitely could not do that without them. Just a few weeks earlier, Orion Township hosted an outdoor event to encourage families to celebrate the arrival of fall. Orion Township's Fall Festival of Family Fun returned to Camp Agawam after a brief hiatus in 2020. Although the weather wasn't very cooperative, families still came out to enjoy carnival games, crafts, a petting zoo, music, and food. Local vendors and organizations got in on the fun, and families were able to take a hay wagon ride throughout Camp Agawam. Um, we kind of wanted to have an event that was free for the public, and in the fall time we have a uh, summer event called Summer Sizzle. So we wanted to kind of mimic that, but out at one of our parks that people aren't super familiar with, which is Camp Agawam. So this morning it was very rainy and sad, but the sun is out now and it's warm. And I think we will be having a great event with lots of people. They're, they're coming in one by one and it's, it'll be a tr good turnout. The Fall Festival of Family Fun was created in 2019, but the township was forced to cancel it in 2020 due to the COVID pandemic. Local families seem to welcome its return, and due to its close proximity to the Kaboom Playground, there was no shortage of fun activities for the little ones to enjoy. Orion Township has numerous events and activities geared toward families planned for the upcoming holiday season. For more information, visit orionparks.com.